everyone, JJ Production One with another episode of Binding Rise of Rebirth after the Seal DLC. In the last episode, we played as Kayan, um, beat Boss Wash, uh, The Heart, and, um, Satan, uh, and this episode, we're gonna be playing as Judas. Uh, again. Nope. Oh, Rightness. Um, so I'm, oh, okay. First, first room, mini boss. Uh, that's cool. Honestly, I'm. Not one hundred percent sure we can. W okay, yeah, we can win. Um, I see the tinted rock there, and we can get this. And so far, that's a pretty good start for the first room. <laughs> oh, and uh, golden key. We can blow that up. So yeah. <laughs> Very early to the bond. Okay, I don't want that. That's spider. But actually, I can pick that up. And then I'll just re pick up Book of Belial. I'm just picking these up uh, so that we can um, uh, get the item unlocked. Like, we've technically picked up the item. Um, we've just got enough stuff that I'm just going to wait until we get something that I want. I guess we're taking scapular. Uh, that's pretty good because uh, we only have one heart. So, if we get hit at all right now, if we get hit, we get a soul heart, which is good. I might actually purposefully get hit at some point. Um, there, yeah, there. Because I, I want the soul, I want a soul heart. Because soul hearts are good. And tinted rock. <laughs> Everything's just starting off so great this, this episode. Okay, that's a trinket. Um, Ace of Spades. We're more likely to get um. Uh, we're more likely to get cards as drops, which you know, it's not not an amazing trinket, but it's pretty good. Um, we're finding the Ragman, which is annoying, but we've got um. We've got uh Book of Belial, so we've got enough damage to deal with him. Okay. There, he's, he's down, um, mom's li lipstick, which is a rain drop, and let's go down to the next floor. I'm not, I'm not gonna go into the, cur the curse room, um, because that's stupid. We, we, we don't have enough health yet, um, we, you, you can, mo most of the time you can just stand there and just fire in, and, um, they won't be able to get out before they hit you. So you can you can usually get uh you can usually beat all of them without getting hit by just standing there in the middle and firing. Um But you know. Not 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 really the best strategy because you can get hit. But it works often enough. So it's good enough for me. Okay, so we missed the item room. And we'll just we'll defeat these little these guys. Okay, the enemy is probably right there. And almost there. <laughs> oh come on, a champion of these guys. Oh, it's gonna be annoying. I can't really focus on that guy because okay okay. If that red spider had been a bit more annoying, this could have been bad, because he might have just kept spawning spiders, and there would have been nothing we could do to take him out. Lemon mishap, bad item. Just, just bad item, that's all there is to it. It's not a good item, it's not worth taking. So, let's keep moving to the boss. The boss is fistula, fistula isn't that bad, um... So we should probably, we should, well, I think we'll, we might be able to feed him without taking damage. Um, and I, 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 I don't know, I don't, and I, even if we do take damage, it's not going to be a ton. Okay, that was, that was just, that was just bad luck. I'm not even sure how to describe that. Everything just hit me weird, hit weird. Okay, health up. And rotten baby. Which I'll take, I guess. I probably shouldn't have taken it. 
Uh, we get a soul heart for getting hit down to half a ha ha uh, half a heart. So it's actually gonna be a strategic play to um to go into the uh go to go in here. And there we go. <laughs> okay. As long as we don't get hit here, then we'll be at an overall advantage. The chariot gives us a bit of invincibility um on use, which I probably could have used to make it through there without taking damage, and honestly would have been probably a pretty good play, but I didn't think of it until we were already out. So, let's move down to Caves 1. Uh, flooded Caves 1, I guess, if you want to prove me wrong, game. The, the answer is yes, it does want to prove me wrong. It always does. This is a game that will always go out of its way to prove you wrong. If it can. And even if you are right, it'll still it'll still go out of its way to prove you wrong. Because, uh, that's the thing. You always are wrong. Even if you're right, you're wrong. That's, that's double thing there. Because even if you're right, you're wrong. You're actually wrong. That doesn't make any sense. But, oh well. Okay, soul heart. That's nice because we got it before we did, before we uh, took any damage, any red heart damage. Because um, tip playing Isaac, mo the most important thing to avoid is red heart damage. It is all. It should always be your biggest priority to avoid. Headless baby. It does the damaging blood around us, which it's pretty good. Not you know not not the best, but not the worst. Definitely not the worst familiar. There are definitely worse familiar. <laughs> because, as you can see, he's already doing a decent amount of work. You know, he's not going to ever single-handedly win you a run. But he may stop you from losing a run. Rarely, but, you know, he might. He's also very good for countering these guys, because they always run at you straight forward, because they don't know how to go diagonally. So... We'll always get hit by, almost always get hit by him a decent number of times. You know, it'd be also it'd also be nice if, nice if we could actually hit that guy. <sighs> Those guys who spawn the blue um blue leeches are not annoying. Uh, are, are are annoying. They are definitely not not annoying. Wow, there were three of those, and one of them was just layered on top of the other one. That is weird. I didn't know they did that. Okay, the Forsaken. Forsaken's not horrible. I think we should probably be able to do this without taking damage. Um, I say that definitely jinxing myself. And I will probably get hit. Okay, never mind. We didn't get hit. Magic Mushroom. That is always great. Lord of the Pit. Do I want to take it? Do I not want to take it? Flight's cool. But flight's cool. Like, <laughs> yeah, there, there wasn't really a second... Um, second point there. Oh, I should have picked up the other key, but I, I didn't think of it until I, uh, looked at the map as we went down. Uh, but anyways, we're, we're probably fine. Maybe I could have re-rolled on uh, Lord of the Pit, but I, I didn't really want to because I'm kind of fine with Lord of the Pit. Uh, Lord of the Pit's not a, not a very good item. It's two hearts for just flight. Um... In the original Binding of Isaac, it was flight and a small speed speed up, which is pretty good, but they removed the speed up in uh, Rebirth. So, now the only reason it ever got any use is gone. Um, and so now it is literally just a worse version of, um... Uh, now it is literally just a worse version of, um... Uh, dang it. Um... Okay, I'm really bad at these. I'm, please ignore me being horrible at those. Another familiar. Um, maybe a baby just shoots random familiar attacks. It's pretty decent, but not amazing. Okay, nightlight. Nightlight is a great item. One, it makes so you uh you can't get curse of um curse of darkness, which is really nice because curse of darkness is a very annoying curse. Um. And also, any enemy that's in the light of, um, of the, uh, that's in the light of Nightlight is slowed down. Any shot that's in the light of Nightlight is shown, slowed down. Everything. It's really, really useful. 
Um, so we can just stand here and... Okay, it doesn't work that well on bosses. It also is really annoying to, to uh, maneuver around because it's based on what direction you're pointing, not where your shots are pointing. But, oh well. Um, do we need anything else on this floor? Not really. Let's move down. Um, no item M, sadly. Um, what was I saying? I ha oh, yeah, um. Ah, uh, you know what? Fine, I'll take it. I was tempted to re-roll it, but I didn't. Um, I, I can't remember what the other flight, um, what the other flight double room item is. Flight, it's flight and spectral tears. And I just can't remember the name of it. So, <laughs> So I was gonna I was gonna say that it's just worse than that item in every way, but then I kind of forgot what the name of that item was. Uh, that guy takes hearts and gives you stuff. Oh, Joker's great. Joker's tell Joker just instantly teleports you to the double room. So you know, um, uh, the 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 cracked die or broken die or whatever that one is, is good, but um, you know. If we get, if there's like a shop item or whatever that we want, I guess we'll just pick, we'll, we'll use that. Or something that we want to re-roll, we'll use that. But, for the moment, uh, the Joker is better for us. Um. Yeah, um. Nightlight's really difficult to maneuver because it's based off where your, uh, where your character is pointed. Not where the, um. It's based on where your character is pointed, not where the, uh, your shots are pointed. Which is, you know, annoying. But whatever, uh, okay. Sadly, not Steam Sale, because I would have re-rolled Steam Sale, but oh well. Um. Okay, yeah, yeah, uh, I, I usually just move, seem like, semi-randomly and don't really have my movement near, at all based off my shot direction so I'm pretty bad with uh, the um, nightlight but it is it is an incredible item that is broken remote it's bad I'm not picking it up because it's bad it's, it's that simple um, we're, we're totally gonna get to this to the end of the game and the items there's gonna be like 30 items that I haven't picked up not because we haven't found them, but just because I'm like, they're bad, and they would just worsen our build right now, so I'm not going to pick them up. <laughs> That's, that is 100% going to happen. Okay, moving on. Um, I don't know which direction. Oh, okay. Hey, oh, I was going to say this room's useless, but there's a uh, tinted rock here. So, it's not all, all useless. So her and the devil. Devil's useless. Or, not useless, but it's not great. So I'm not gonna take it because uh, Joker. We have the Joker. Um. So let's move on to the boss. Oh, war! I thought this was um. Saw this was uh depth two. Never mind. Guess it's depth one. Um. So I'll use um. I I I'm I'm gonna go back there. Um. Okay. I should have uh, I should have bought the crack die, but I didn't. Um, I'm gonna use crack die to re-roll re -roll the um cube of meat because while cube of meat is good, um. Oh, never mind. We oh wow did I just take damage there because I'm an idiot? Never mind. We left cursed uh, crack die on the last floor. So I'm an idiot. I guess we're taking cube of meat going down. Maybe I didn't leave it on the last floor, and maybe I am just an idiot. We'll never know. But I know I'm an idiot for taking all that stupid, stupid damage there. Okay. Cursed Eye, with the decent amount of damage we have, is pretty good. We should be able to take out most things. Okay, okay. Boss room on depth two. You cannot leave De uh, unless you teleport out. But the Joker is not a teleport out. The Joker teleports you to the um, to the uh, Devil Room, and when you leave the Devil Room, you go back to the room where you were before. So when we leave the Devil Room, we actually go to um, we go back to the Boss Room. So I'm not going to the Boss Room yet, 
because uh, I don't want to be stuck there, which would mean we don't get the item room. Um, if we get to like 18 minutes and we haven't gotten the item room yet, maybe I'll go to the boss room. But probably not. Uh, we do have, yeah, we do have boss rush. So we don't need to, we don't, we don't, we don't need to hurry to, to do boss rush. Okay. Speed up, that's nice. Power pill isn't really useful. So let's continue on. Oh, don't do jumping, jump, jump things. I hate, I hate these guys, especially in the, um, the half form. Where they shoot shots just like weird directionally. Because I'm really bad at dodging it. Oh, come on. I thought I dodged that. Dang it. I'm, I'm really bad with these spikes. Okay. And we're good. Okay, there is a shop here. Oh, come on. None of those items are good. Uh, like, none of those items are really good for us. I mean, I guess we'll take, um, charged battery. It just drops batteries every once in a while. But, you know, we don't have it yet. So there's no point in not picking it up. Uh, black candle, um, black, black candle's pretty good. Um, let's just, you know, continue filling up, filling up this with all the money we have. Okay, jammed at exactly 15 cents. Um... Maybe we'll find a, um, maybe we'll find a, uh, just a giant pile of, um, of items, of, um, skulls somewhere, something that we can blow up, because, uh, we need soul hearts. Oh, come on, super greed. Don't do it. Don't super greed. I'm bad at dodging super greed sometimes. Um... There's just a couple bosses that shot pattern, and I'm just not good with dodging. Virgo. I don't even remember what Virgo does. I think it means that all pills are good. Um, and it does something else, but I don't remember what that something else is. So, let's go battle fight mom. Um, we need to be careful not to get hit, because, um, remember, if we get hit, it'll teleport us out. Which, theoretically speaking, we could use in boss rush. We can make sure we get hit while charging, and hope it teleports us, um... Oh, come on, the spoon. That's horrible. Let's speed up. Uh, and we, we could hope it, uh, gets us out of the, um, boss rush. Okay, I'm gonna use Book of Revelations. I'm just gonna keep it with us, because we need soul hearts. And Krampus, in the tiny room. We can't really beat him here without, yeah, just doing that. Pause. Uh, invincibility. Okay, let's move down. Uh, we need the, um... Uh, we, I was taking Book of Revelations because we have very little health. And, uh, we don't want to have very little health. We want to have a lot of health. You know, should probably go without saying. Oh, there's a secret room somewhere over here. Um, uh... If I don't know if you could hear, if you could or couldn't hear that, but there was the uh, secret room sound for here. Okay, I'm not going to pick those up. Uh, I like the batteries. That's good. Uh, I, I don't regret picking up uh, the battery dropper, dude. But uh, we, I, we have one charge left right now, so I don't want to waste that one. I don't want to waste, uh, I don't want to essentially waste a battery charge or a book of revelations charge. Um, so I'm just, just getting as many soul hearts as we can here. And there's another battery. So, yeah, <laughs> that, now we've got definitely enough health. And in here, nothing good. Bob's brain, meh item. It's, it's essentially, it's a bomb that fires at, fires at things. It's not, not all that good. Okay. So, let's keep going. Okay, okay. How am I gonna get through this room? Like this. That's how. Um, we might not be able to get, um, another full charge of, uh, Book of Revelations. But there's no point in not trying. So, that's why I haven't picked up that battery yet. Um, 
I mean, technically speaking, it actually, uh, it would be better if we couldn't, if we, if, if, if we couldn't, and I picked it up, it would be better, because that would give us, uh, more charges on the next floor, but whatever, oh, yeah, yeah, we're gonna get it, we're gonna have enough space to get a charge, but I, I, I know we won't be able to get another charge, um, so I'm gonna use, uh, I'm gonna use it here. Oh, and anyways, we're fully charged, so there's no point in not. That made no sense, did it? I don't think it did. Okay. This room's fine, because we have uh, the ability to just shoot through things pretty easily. 48-hour energy. That's some free soul hearts. And, oh, okay, let's fight death. Um... He's guaranteed to drop, uh... Well, that didn't work. He's guaranteed to drop cube of meat, um... Technically speaking, that was a uh, even battle, because he did drop, um... He did drop a battery. Uh, we, the, the, the battery, battery dude, little battery, or whatever his name is, did drop a battery. Oh, come on. No, stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it. Bomb, fire. Bob's brain, fire. Don't kill us. Okay. That, I'm trying, I'm just trying to take out him without taking out these, okay, there we go. <laughs> I was just trying to explain what I was doing while hitting these guys. Okay, for Babylon and Ceremonial Robes. Ceremonial Robes is three black hearts and, um, and a damage increase, which is nice. Uh, technically speaking, apparently, I'm not 100% sure about this, but apparently, um, ceremonial robes only increase, wow, that was bad, doesn't increase your, uh, dam doesn't increase your damage until the next floor, why is everything so fast, stop, stop it, slow down, slow down, slow down, oh my gosh, everything was way too fast there, we need that soul heart, and we need that soul heart, two batteries, that's enough soul heart, that's not, no, not enough soul hearts, never enough soul hearts, one, you, you can't, ever have enough soul hearts. Unless you have max soul hearts. But you can never have more than enough soul hearts. Paralysis, okay. And are you a wizard? Good it good pills doesn't actually mean good pills, I guess. Just not bad pills. Okay, transcendence gives us flight. Um I'm just waiting till uh are you wizard wears off wear off wear off <laughs> it it is always too long like it is always just like in annoyingly too long oh yeah I forgot um I forgot charge charge baby uh Little Battery could do that. He can uh, stun every enemy in the room for, like, a second and a half. Which is really useful. Um, this isn't actually where, uh, Church Baby is the best. It, uh, there is a, um, there's a, there's a place in time where it's much better. But we'll get there eventually. Okay. The heart. Let's take out the heart. Not get hit too many times. Please. Okay. This should this shouldn't be too bad. I think we can win unless I play poorly, which is an an option 100% of the time. You know, it's never completely unlikely. Well, and also uh, if I ever get hit while I'm charging, we send we get teleported out. And there we go. Soul heart and we move down to Shoal. So we can beat Shoal here. Okay. We unlocked question mark question mark question mark. We unlocked the blue womb. Oh, that's where we could have bought fought um Hush. We unlocked question mark question mark question mark. He's a new character. I guess we'll play him in the next Okay. I guess we'll play question mark question mark question mark in the uh, next one. Um not my favorite character, but not my least favorite character. Def definitely not my favorite character though. Much closer to least favorite. Um, I'm not gonna risk that coin because I'm lazy. Um, honestly, overall, we've gotten neutral from um, 
cursed eye. You know, we've gotten teleported to new places just as often as we've gotten teleported away from where we want to be. Um, because, uh, cursed, cursed eye can really mess you up. I've had that happen many times. And I'll admit that mess up at the beginning was... Uh, at the beginning of this floor was my fault. Like, <laughs> I just wasn't paying attention and got hit by that guy. Um, but yeah, we've, we've got a decent amount of soul hearts, which is nice. Okay. Okay, where are you? No. There. Pick up. Pick you up. Uh, I, w I was not calm. I was pretty confident I was going to take damage there. Like, the chance of not taking damage there was pretty slim. Um. Okay, there we go. We defeated, um. We defeated Peep. Uh, let's move on over here because I don't want to go back in that room if possible. Um. Come on. Just, just get hit. There we go. And money, really, 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 really not useful, but whatever. Okay, and there we go. Managed to take out everyone. What? What even hit us there? Oh, it was one of those guys again. Come on. Okay, let's go back over there. We cannot fight those guys very well. Or, no, I mean, I'm just, I'm just not good at taking those guys on with cursed eye. The devil, why not? You know what? We could, we could find use for it. There we go. He's down. Soul heart. Okay, so that room. No. Oh God. What even is this room? I don't like it. I don't like this room. Did did we def did we technically clear that room? Yes, we did. So let's get the soul heart and let's face it. Oh yeah, we we do have use for the devil. Okay, fallen shouldn't be too much of a problem. We do need to be careful not to get hit because remember we get teleported out if we get hit, or we will often get teleported out if we get hit like we just did there. Oh boy, I'm gonna need to play really well for this. Oh, I hit one of them. I only hit one of them. I see the soul heart there. I'm not picking it up yet on purpose. Because there may be a time when we really want it. I picked it up there. Oh, come on. Come on. Okay, okay, here we go. We need to be very careful here. Stop, stop, stop spawning the leeches. Stop spawning the leeches. No! No, no! What even hit me? What even hit me? Oh my gosh. We're so close there. This is going to be a really long run, guys. Because I don't know if we can do this. Okay. There we go. That was pretty good timing. Oh, come on. F should freeze them for like one second longer. Come on, come on, hit, get hit, get hit, hit you, hit you. Okay, okay, we need to be careful here. Don't get hit while you're charging. Be very careful, okay, okay, there we go. Okay, so just don't get hit. It should be pretty simple. Should be pretty simple, right? Right, Josh? Pretty simple. Just don't get hit, and you'll win. They can't. There we go. That was close. Okay. We unlocked the negative. So that means something really special. We also unlocked 
Question mark, question mark, question mark, a.k.a. Blue Baby. And he is who we'll be playing in the next episode, which I'm really, really, really not looking forward to. So, until then, goodbye.